So the offensive line's been juggled. We'll get into this story. Here is Judd on the toss play. Did not practice, Jez. You got two freshmen now playing both tackle spots against one of the best D lines in the SEC. Play action. Kelly downfield. And it's broken up. Good job swatting it away. On second and ten, they keep it airborne. Throw it in. It's it on third downs like this. Big weapon. Stands tall. Very close. Now Ingram will take a break, and Zettergren checks in, and Ole Miss yeah. number 23 motions out of the backfield. Fires complete over the middle of. But they look good here tonight, early. Keeping it in the air. Play action to Brasley. Kelly fires and. That's an Ole Miss catch. Yeah, it was, and they signaled the other way. The head linesman. But it was low to get lined up. Deflected, incomplete, and here comes a huge third down. Three wide receivers are to the left in this formation. He goes to the right, got one on one, got the first down with Stringfellow to the 10 yard line. Really strong coming back to the ball. First and goal, opening drive of the game. End zone, and there's a penalty throw. Play as a unit. Ingram's on the right side of the formation. Kelly's looking back to him. Touchdown, Evan Ingram. Fake pitch here to Akeem Judd to the right, and that sucked up safety Trey Matthews in the middle linebacker to Sean Davis. That challenging Chad Kelly. And he's going to go against the coverage. Snatched out of the sky on that saw, and they went after it. Yeah, and Adebojo beats the man-to-man -man coverage there by Carlton Davis. He's the best cover guy for Auburn. No defense for a perfectly placed throw. Kelly now to the other side, a little bit high. Duress, Montrevious Adams, number one. Just smoked through the line of scrimmage and got a great shot on Chad Kelly. Munch coordinator's game plan. There's that play action. Got one on one far side. Incomplete. Exactly what they do on the top of the screen. But and a quick one to the outside. And Brasley for a first for an attack, don't they? Here's Brasley. To the 27 yard line. Now Ole Miss freezes that defense by not substituting. Play action. Fires middle to the five yard line. Now keeping the defense frozen. Can't substitute. Man, that was good. Now it'll be now he's right there tightening yeah. up. He can strike from that spot. He releases late. They're going to throw back to him. A danger. Kelly comes back to the short side and Lodge. Kelly forced out of the pocket. Thrown down. Moving his position on that defensive front. Catch. First down. Kelly. Fires in. Because he's been able to be healthy. Here's the speed coming along the outside working against Two freshman tackles. He's sudden. He's explosive. Keep an eye on that right offensive tackle. They need a little help before the night's over. High, and that is complete. Was that spring fellow going up? They've got their hands full. Third down and four. Quarterback draw by Kelly. Will not get the first down because of that. Read option. First down. Quarterback was handing it off. Watch right here, number number one. He runs with the running back thinking it was going to be handed off, and that opened the lane right where he vacated. Chases after number 23, Brasley, and that opens up the hole. For 33, Judd's the running back. Judd steps out to the left. And strong run. Close to and Kelly's going to do it, but Lawson says, no, you're not. Their backup right guard, Bolden, in the game, and he's the one that time that gets matched up with Carl Lawson, and it's just of the Ole Miss offensive line. Kelly, incomplete. And it, they like to toss it quickly to the outside. And they, As you saw right there, he's got a lot of agility. No, on the boundary side. Kelly fires it to a wide open Judd. 
Offensive line tries it. Kelly has to throw this away. Because of that injury. Kelly. Wide open in the middle. Down at the 10 yard line, 26 seconds. Led to that second run, Santana. In a big fly for the Indians. They're now ahead 2 1. And Judd drops it. 20. Look from Ole Miss. Second down and goal. Kelly chucks it away in the pocket. Rushing four. They flush him out of the pocket. He fires incomplete. Nine seconds left. Off there by that group. First down and 10 from the 22. Kelly fires over the middle. And the tempo can't do it tonight. It was a 10 yard gain for a first down. Kelly's keeping it around the left side. There was a whole tough run. Play action. Got one on one. Goes over the top. Incomplete. Beautiful. Second down and 10. Throws to A.J. Brown who breaks a tackle. And he's to the third. Between these two teams. Got Brown again. To the backfield. Quick pitch over on that wing. They're inside the five yard line. You got to keep it all the way. Back inside the center and Conyers again playing Josh Conyers over. And then he gets a hold of the quarterback. That was all Adams. And he's running around them too. Watch this right here. There's, here's your matchup. Right out of the snap. Leverage gets his hands on the center, pushes him backwards, and it disrupts the timing in the run game. And not only that, then has the agility to pounce on top of the quarterback Peller. Just plays with low pad level of strength. He's blocked the extra point. He's been good in pass rush and good in run defense. And Peller not going to get the first down. Take a look at from the overhead view of this. It just never opened up. Hit in the backfield and just never able to get close. Pressure. Quick release to the outs out there. Third down. Penalty flag. Play now on this third down and short. Forced out of the pocket on the move. And he is going to. Lawson. He's having problems. He's had his hands full all night. See the bull rush by Lawson. You see the, the grab the jersey there on the left shoulder of Lawson. That gave Chad Kelly the opportunity. Now they've got Carl Lawson lined up at linebacker right in here. They're moving him around, trying to get him isolated. You expect him to rush the passer. Now he's working against a guard. Sacked back at the 48 yard line by Jeff Holland. You got all these guys sliding this way. This is the guy that's going to make the sack. Look at all the red jerseys that are surrounding him, and he splits two. This offensive line, they're banged up. They're 21 yard gain on that. Now the toss play. Have to do it against contested coverage. Slant. Got it. Touchdown. Throwing the football here. It's a small window on a slant throw. It's got to get out early to beat the linebacker. Good velocity. Right into the breadbasket on the body and tight coverage. Just got to kind of wonder, Brent, moving forward now. Two point. You'll remember Coach Freeze told us yesterday we didn't fear Montrevious Adams last year, but he's a different player this year. Ole Miss's offensive line coach Matt Luke saying he's the best inside guy they have seen anywhere all year. Now, Auburn's coaches, for their part, say like any guy who experiences success, you then try to master your craft at a higher degree. Adams has found his niche. It's just like the growth curve you see of a lot of players in college football. Kaylee had a chance to go to the NFL a year ago, decided to stay. Auburn obviously happy he did. Kelly on the move. Watching him here tonight, Archie Manning. There's a toss to the outside, and Judd not going to get the first down. Third and two. Kelly throws. Income. Lodge working one-on-one -on -one with Joshua Holsley. Puts it right where he needs to put it. 
Just Lodge not able to come up with it, and the Auburn's the only thing that cures that, and Auburn's been able to handle it. Kelly fires. And defense to climb back in. 18 more yards. Floats one, one on one. In, barring a couple of huge losses. Sacks. Drops it off now to the running back. Right now. Slant right there. Incomplete. And I'll make it fourth down. Here's the running back. They motion him out. And taking over.